Hey everybody, Michael with Rogers Rants. Just want to confess I've been keeping a little bit of a secret from y'all. But today we're going to reveal it. I want to share with y'all my dream flower garden. This is a project that's been in the making for over two months. It's been my plan to do this for a year. As y'all know, if y'all have seen my previous video, I have been down and out in my back and haven't been able to function for about six weeks. And through uh, light medication and physical rehab, I've been able to get out with a lot of Jennifer's help. And we have accomplished this. Now the only thing incomplete as you can see there's not fencing here in the front uh, we do have the fencing uh, we just need to put it up and it will be complete but each bed is handmade I made these with the help of Jennifer she she got to enjoy burning the wood with me what we did is we uh, this is a pine these are 8 by 4 beds and uh, we burned the wood and then I sealed it with a water sealer uh, on the inside. We're not going to be using these uh, for vegetable gardens. These are all flower gardens. This bed right here uh, is two variety of sunflowers. Uh, cannot wait. As you can see, we've already got some sunflowers popping up uh, just different varieties one is a chocolate I forget the other one this bed has native Texas wildflowers and milkweed this bed is going to be another variety of sunflower we did clean up this corner bed today I've got some daylilies um, and then a couple of other varieties this bed was a mess and it's finally completed got got mulch down picked up these six by i think these are six by four or six by six by two or, or sorry six by three bed off of amazon they've also got texas wildflowers in them uh the fencing is going to be all the way around with some form of gate entrance we still have to get like i said we've got the other panels to finish the, the majority of this front uh we're just tired but a big shout out to my better half jennifer she's really been helpful i'm making sure that i'm not overdoing it but I will tell you, uh, I feel like I'm about 90% back to normal. Thanks for everybody's prayers and concerns. But I wanted to share this beautiful flower garden that we're going to have. I'm really hoping that everything blooms. You know, we're in Texas, so we have plenty of time, plenty of summer sun. We're going to see how it turns out, and I'm going to keep you all along. For the journey of stuff starts blooming uh i just did this for the beauty of it you know i wanted to be able to bring in more butterflies and and more hummingbirds and just a something to add to the you know natural beauty that we've tried to collect oh we got a a spy old duke staring at the window wondering what daddy's doing right in front of Daisy's flower garden but uh, yeah that's uh, that's it that's the the secret I hope y'all uh, like the work that we've put in please give it a thumbs up uh, leave a comment subscribe to the channel if you're not already click the notification bell so each time we upload a video you get notified so you don't miss out on anything. I know y'all have been keeping up with the uh, 
second spring garden this is spring garden of 2024 oh I see mr. caterpillar on that corn but as you can see we've got some ears of corn tomatoes are are budding we got mr. cucumber plant coming in and some pepper plants uh, but yeah uh, I really love the landscaping it's relaxing I love coming out and looking at it I hope y'all enjoy looking at it as well when I share it with y'all uh, I always forget what type of plant this is but isn't this beautiful there is some Texas wildflowers planted in this they haven't produced yet everything's growing and look at this y'all it's a big carrot plant but anyway that's what I wanted to share with y'all thank y'all for uh, stopping in and uh, you'll have a blessed weekend and We'll see you on the next video.